Hey everyone! Today we're going to explore how to upload your Unity build to Steam using the Steam console. Open your browser and go to partner.steamgames.com. Once you're logged in, go to the top menu and click on SDKS. After it's done downloading, go to your downloads folder, right-click the ZIP file, and extract it somewhere easy to find, for example, your desktop or a Steam SDK folder. Next, we'll navigate to the Steamworks SDK folder you just downloaded. Inside, go to Tools Content Builder Content. This is where we'll prepare the files for uploading to Steam. Now create a new folder here. You can name it anything you like, the name doesn't matter. This folder will hold all the files for your Unity build. This is the folder that Steam's console tool will read from when we upload the build. So make sure it's ready before moving on to the next step. All right, now that our build folder is ready, it's time to launch Steampipe. Steampipe is the tool that communicates with Steam and uploads your content. Now we're inside the Steam Build Uploader. This tool lets us upload our Unity build to Steam easily. First, you'll see the App ID field. This is the unique ID of your game on Steam. You can find it in your Steamworks dashboard. Make sure to enter it correctly because Steam uses this ID to know which game to update. Next is the Depot ID. Each depot represents a part of your game, like Windows, Mac, or Linux builds. If this is your first upload, you'll likely have one depot. Enter the correct depot ID for the platform you're uploading. Now, we need to select the build folder we created earlier. Click on the folder selection button and navigate to the folder inside Tools Content Builder Content that contains your Unity build. This is the folder Steam will read from when uploading. Generate VDFS, the uploader creates the necessary configuration files for Steam to read your build. Once everything looks correct, click Upload. Steam Build Uploader will start sending your files to Steam. You'll see progress and logs in the console window. This will tell you if anything goes wrong during the upload. After the upload is complete, go to your Steamworks dashboard and check the build under the correct branch. I hope this guide helps you. If you found this video helpful, subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any future tutorials. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.